We're talking with Nick Bittell, who's the chief executive of the marathon, and about the major economic impact that the race has. Nick, give us some figures. What does the Virgin London Marathon do in terms of boosting London and indeed the UK's economy? Well, I think uh, most people will be aware that the race raises an amazing amount of money for our charity. Uh, last year, over £50 million pounds was raised by the runners between them. But I think the surprise that people will have is the overall economic impact. And it's an amazing total, over £110 million pounds was the positive effect on the British economy just from that one day. And these are businesses, big and small, who are benefiting from runners and indeed their families, who may be coming from uh, Europe and beyond to run this great race. Yes. Those sort of figures are made up of an array of businesses who are benefiting from hotels, uh, over 110,000 room nights uh, for the weekend and the, the wider week, down to restaurants and pubs and theatres, all of whom are be benefiting from the fact that we have over 750,000 people lining the streets watching the race uh, on the day. And this is one of the, the trends in big city marathons, isn't it? This is a very significant economic impact that not only London, but all the bigger races around the world have. It's not just the economic impact, which is a very important, of course, especially now in heightened, uh, straightened circumstances that economists find themselves in. Uh, but it's also the fact that it's the showcase for a city around the world. This race will be seen in over 160 countries around the world. And that's a, a rather large advertisement for the joys of London being seen uh, all over the globe. Very significant also that this is in the build up to the Olympics next year and the Virgin London Marathon is, is part of in a sense the celebration of London, the capital and Britain. 2012 we'll see uh, an amazing uh, year, not just because of the Olympics, but also for things like the Queen's Jubilee that will also be happening in 2012. So London's going to be the focus of a great number of celebrations uh, next year. And the Virgin London Marathon is going to be the kickoff, I think, for a lot of those celebrations. And even though these are tough economic times for many, do you still anticipate that, that economic drive continuing? Uh, certainly we're seeing that uh, the growth in charity, uh, the growth in what people are spending on preparing uh, for this great adventure that it is for over 36,500 people. That is continuing and I'm seeing that we are going to see more and more of a positive impact from an event such as the Virgin London Marathon. It's a fascinating insight Nick, thanks very much. Thank you.